at me because I have your suit. Anyway, enjoy Reaper as I tell the story of the day Dora had too much Mexican food. <laughs> Dora is an explorer. She explores. She is also Mexican, so she stuffs her mouth with shit tons of taquitos. Which are good for you, by the way. This isn't in the story, but this, this is true. She had once gone far over the line, though. This is the story of the day Dora just had too much Mexican food. Dora was about ready to teach some dull children about Candy Mountain, but she had just she had, had about three burritos left. When she finished those bad boys off, the camera started rolling. Hola! I'm Dora! Are you ready to go to Candy Mountain? She then proceeded to make her way to her destination. What? Yeah, I found it. Uh, I think it already sh said that. Uh, which way should we go? A branching path led to either a river or a Taco Bell. <laughs> Dora knew she had to go follow. She had to follow the script, but she needed more food. Completely disregarding the planned story, Dora went to the Taco Bell and ordered the spiciest taco on the menu. She had it, and it tasted good. She then ordered another, then another, then another. Dora noticed she was getting a little bigger with each bite of the taco. Boots the monkey said, Hey Dora, it's about time we go to the right path again. No habla ingles, pendejo. Boots was surprised. Mostly because Dora just called him an asshole. <laughs> But also because Dora looked like an exercise ball after she'd eaten her 10th super spicy taco. Boots urged Dora to stop eating, but she didn't listen. Suddenly, Dora cried out in pain. She shortly afterwards let out an unholy Mexican fart and everyone died. <laughs> Nobody died from the stench, but actually from the because of the fact that her flatulent attack was so big that it caused a black hole to be born, immediately devouring Earth as we knew it. However, Dora was not dead. She was trapped in a frozen universe. This meant no tacos were being cooked. Dora was at a loss for words. She needed more Mexican food, god damn it. <laughs> it's okay, I'll post this on YouTube later. <laughs> I'm going to get so much <laughs> Dora scoured the land looking for maybe another taco. She found no food, but she did walk in on her parents having intense intercourse, but frozen in time. Still no food. She couldn't handle not being able to eat half enchiladas, so she chose to die. She was trapped with all of the cells of the people who had, were vacuumed in. Dora was forced to live in a personal purgatory for the rest of her life. The end. <laughs> 3DS. I fucking love your... I fucking love you, man. Uh...